Welcome to another broadcast for Louder News. I'm Alessandra Santone, reporting on the recent field trip the communication arts students took to the KISS 108 headquarters, home of the famous Jingle Ball. We started our day following Mr. O'Connor in the UA minibus while we serenaded Mrs. Paulus as she drove. When we arrived, we were greeted by Lisa Donovan, who was one of hosts for Maddie in the Morning, along with Billy Costa, who also introduced himself. It was a pleasant surprise when Jammin 94.5's host Romero Torres, DJ Pup Dog, and Ashley Feldman introduced themselves and were more than willing to take pictures with us. Then we met our host for the day, Kendra Patron, who gave us a tour of the studio. While Kendra was giving our tour, Maddie was still on air doing what he does best. Roaming through the hallways, we saw the multitude of autographed photos from various artists. After the long-awaited hype, Maddie was finally off air and answered some of our questions. When he was done, he was presented with an Ursuline Superfan t-shirt and became an honorary Superfan. Way to go, Maddie. Kendra also became an official Ursuline Superfan as well. Then she took us into the studio where all the magic happened. You did not have to ask the girls to get behind the mic. It was natural to them. It was also very interesting to see the equipment used during the Maddie in the Morning show. Then Kendra gave us the juicy gossip about the kind celebrities compared to the divas. At the end of our tour, we took pictures with Kendra, who was a fantastic hooker. Then was back behind the minibus, traveling through Boston to get to the historical Doyle's Restaurant and Cafe. While we were there, we were surrounded by Boston's history while we enjoyed our lunch. It was a delicious ending to an already perfect day.